The United Nations right now looks like 1952, and three years from now, when we finish the Capital Master Plan, it will look even more like 1952, except it will be far greener, far safer, far more sustainable, and a more functional set of buildings. We are moving the UN conference building into the temporary conference building this week. This is the packing up process. The art will slowly move to the temporary building now. It's a very powerful moment for the UN. This art has, has made this a home for 60 years. It's all gifts from the member states and now it will decorate the walls of the temporary building for two years and then come back home again. Now I'm going to take you on what has been dubbed the dirty tour. I'll take you to the bowels of the UN headquarters when we tried to convince the UN member states that it was time for a renovation of the UN headquarters. They didn't really believe us until we decided to take them on the dirty tour and open their eyes and show them things that they don't really see every day when they do their usual business in this building. And that worked. All our building systems are state-of-the-art 1950s and energy efficiency, uh, global warming, those were not issues that the designers had to take into account. This is the, the deepest we can get in the UN headquarters. We are probably around 10 feet below the East River surface. We are using river water from the East River to cool our machines. Here we are in the General Assembly Hall. It's the heart of the UN, this is the core. This is the room which the UN was built for. And it's, and it's been serving its purpose very well for these 60 years. We're going to gut the room and then bring it back to exactly the way it looked in 1952. The ceilings will be removed, the asbestos has to come out from behind the walls. We'll also be taking the, all the furniture out, all these wonderful tables and chairs. We'll move it out, we'll remove the floor and put the air conditioning underneath the floor, and then we'll bring it all back. This was built at the inception of the United Nations. This has been here for over 60 years. This is all hardwired, linking every conference room in the building to the radio studios, the TV studios, to reporter studios upstairs. Here's WNYC. Okay, here it is, WNYC. All of this is gonna go away really soon and it's going to be replaced by something about this size. <laughs>